Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, we are going to look at how you can contribute to the Polkadot and Kusama Parachain Auction crowd loans via Polkadot.js and also via the mobile application Fearless Wallet. In this video, we will demonstrate how to use Polkadot.js and Fearless Wallet to participate in the crowd loans. These two wallets are slightly different from each other. For example, Fearless Wallet is very user friendly whereas Polkadot.js can be quite confusing for newcomers. However, personally, we use Polkadot.js to participate in the crowd loans. A word of caution before we continue. Centralized exchanges such as Kraken, KuCoin, and even potentially Binance will allow users to participate in the Polkadot crowd loans. Remember, when your funds are on a centralized exchange, you do not own your private keys, and in the past, the centralized exchanges have withheld crowd loan rewards such as tokens, NFTs, private sale allocations, etc. The individual project teams cannot assist you with any issues if you participate via a CEX and you must contact the exchange directly. Additionally, please note that some crowd loans require KYC to enter. This was the case with Karura and Moon River on Kusama. So expect the Akala and Moonbeam crowd loans to require some form of KYC to be able to participate. This video does not give a detailed explanation of how to send DOT or KSM tokens to your Substrate account. However, very simply, head on over to your centralized exchange of choice, click withdraw, paste in your corresponding DOT or KSM address, select the correct network, either DOT or KSM, enter the amount you would like to send to that address, and then press withdraw. Please exercise caution when doing this. If you withdraw to the wrong address, your funds may be lost permanently. Let's begin with Polkadot.js. Head on over to polkadot.js.org and click on the extension. Here you want to download the extension for either Chrome or Firefox, in my case Firefox, and add the extension to your browser. Once the extension has been downloaded, it should appear in the top right of your web browser. Click on it and press understood. Let me continue. You can press on the plus and here you can choose to create a new account. You should write down the seed phrase, the 12 word mnemonic seed, if you are creating a new account. For this demonstration, however, we will import account from pre-existing seed because we already have an account. Simply type in your 12 word mnemonic seed here. Go ahead and give your account a name, in our case test account, and input your password for the account. And press add the account with the supplied seed. Now you have created your account, and if you head on over to the apps wallet hosted, Press yes, allow this application access on the pop-up. Make sure you choose the correct network. In our case, we want to choose the Kusama network. Once you have selected the correct network, either Polkadot or Kusama, you want to head on over to the network tab. From here, click on the parachains button and then go ahead and click on crowd loan. Here you will see a list of the ongoing crowd loans, as well as the projects which have successfully completed their crowd loan. After some time, the page should have loaded successfully. So let's go ahead and contribute to the Picasso crowd loan. Simply press on the contribute button on the right hand side, input your contribution amount, in our case we're going to choose 0.1 KSM, and then press on the contribute button, and then sign and submit the transaction, and input the password for the account in the polka.js extension pop-up. Now you can see that the contribution of 0.1 KSM is displayed successfully. You can download Fearless Wallet from the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. If you press create account, you can create a brand new account on the Kusama or Polkadot networks. Simply name your account and then press next and write down your backup mnemonic seed phrase. In our case, we will import the account which we previously made on Polkadot.js. Simply input the mnemonic seed phrase and your account will be added onto Fearless Wallet. 
You may need to create a PIN code at this point, so simply input a six digit PIN code to continue. Afterwards, your account should appear. To participate in the CrowdLearn, simply press the CrowdLearns button at the bottom of the screen, navigate to the project which you wish to participate in, in our case Robonomics, input the amount of KSM you wish to contribute, press continue, review the information and press confirm. Now if you head back to the CrowdLearns tab and scroll down to Robonomics, you can see that our contribution is clearly displayed in the application. And that's it for this video guys. If you would like to see more content like this in the future, then please consider subscribing to my channel. Also, if you would like to get the latest news and updates, then follow me on Twitter. Thanks and see you next time.